So hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you a great ad blocker to use if you have this first app that is highlighted on your Fire Stick. So stay tuned, I'll show you how to install it and how to set it up. It's time for streaming. So hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Thanks for tuning in, I really do appreciate it. Today I'm working on the Fire Stick 4K Max second generation. If you're looking for a new device, check out my description down below. A couple of different links in there. Click on the link, no extra cost to you. Small commission comes to the channel to get other devices so that way I can show you how they work. And it keeps bringing you some more videos. Thank you very much if you do click on one of the links. Also, please remember while you are streaming, protect yourself from your internet provider. Use a VPN. The one that I use that's really great with low, low prices, and you can connect to as many devices as you like, is IP Vanish VPN. Check out their low prices. Go ahead and get a subscription and stream safe. So here we are on the home screen of the Fire Stick 4K Max second generation. So a lot of people right now may have this app that's in the first position that is highlighted. And you notice that when you go ahead and you open it up, all of a sudden the ad takes over the screen. I'm gonna show you how you can block that. People got in touch with me and said the last one that I showed them about to block ads is really not working. So this one here I've been using for a while, works really great. I wanna bring it to your attention and hopefully it works for you. So here we go. The first thing you're gonna need is downloader. Now, if you don't have downloader, what you're gonna need to do is go over to the magnifying glass, come on down to search, click on search, click on the letter D, come on down, click on downloader. Once you click on it, it's gonna say you own it, click on it, install it, and then you can open it up. I already have it, so let me go back to the home screen and show you the next steps to go ahead and get this ad blocker. So let's go over to Downloader, click on it, open it up, and where it says enter a URL search term or short code, that's what I have in here right now, 218330. Click on it, that's the shortcut code to type for streaming webpage. Once you type it in, just click on go. Give it a few seconds for the page to come in, and then I'll show you the next step. If you like what you're seeing, please click on that like and subscribe button, ring that bell. This way you know when I do put up some more videos, so that way some of the videos that I show you do help you out with all your streaming needs. So here it is on the Time for Streaming webpage. Let's go over to the right, click on the three lines, and come on down to where it says Downloads. Click on Downloads. Let's wait for the page to change, and then scroll on down. Go all the way down. We're going to be looking for ad blockers. Now, the one that you want is called Block Adder. Let's go ahead and click on Block Adder. Give that a few seconds. It's going to go ahead and download for us. Then it's going to switch over and say Install. Click on Install. Doesn't take long. Once it does get finished downloading, you want to say Done. Click on Done, Delete, and Delete. This here, you're just going ahead and you're deleting the file from the downloader app. Click on that home button on your remote. Now let's go over to your apps or the three squares and the plus sign. Anytime you download something new, it's always at the bottom. So let's go on down to the bottom. Let's find it. Make sure it's highlighted. If you like, click on that three line button on your remote. Scroll down, move the front, goes right up to the top position. Click on that home button on your remote. If you made that move, here it is, first position. Highlight it, click the enter button on your remote, and let's open it up. Now, if you like, you could go ahead and download the new version, or you just could go ahead and close it. For this demo, I'm just going to go ahead and close it right now. So this way I can show you how to enable the block adder, so that way you can block the ads on that favorite app that I showed you. Now remember, this will only work on third party apps. This will not work on YouTube, will not work on Hulu, Netflix, anything like that. It's only for your third party apps. So once you come to this screen on your directional pad on your remote, you wanna go ahead and click up. You wanna make sure that the heart 
is highlighted. This is how you're gonna know where your mouse is. Come on down one time, click the end of the button on your remote. Click down again until you highlight where it says continue. Click on it. Now let's go ahead, click OK. Come down again, click on it to continue highlights. Click it, and now you see it's in blue. So now your block adder has been activated and it's going to block the ads. Let's go ahead now and click that home button on our remote. I hope you find this video very helpful and entertaining. Let me know down below if this version of Block Adder helps you out with your third party apps, like the one I showed you at the beginning, which name I won't mention. Let me know if it helped you block the ads at the beginning when you're going ahead and you're searching through to find the favorite show that you want to watch. Click on that like and subscribe button, ring that bell. This way you know when I do put up some more videos, go ahead and share the video, tell your friends, drop on in to time for streaming. I really do appreciate it. And remember, day or night, it's time for streaming.